Ladies and gentlemen, I am here in the ring with the legend killer, Randy Orton. Uh, everybody wants to know, Randy, why did you RKO and beat the living hell out of mankind last episode and then unmask him, which is extremely disrespectful? You see, the reason why I did that was to show how dominant I could be in this industry and how dominant the new Randy Orton can be and is. You see, I've always been behind everybody else in this business and I've never stood on top. Well now it's time for that change where Randy Orton becomes not only a legend killer but a viper as well. Mankind doesn't have any balls compared to me in this business. He says he's always extreme but he's not even close to being as extreme as Randy Orton and quite frankly it just goes to show that Randy Orton is unstoppable. Well, you heard it from here, from Randy Orton himself. Oh my God! He just RKO'd the ring announcer. What the heck? But oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. It's, it's mankind, mankind going after Randy Orton here. And now he takes the, the microphone off his. Listen to me, Randy. And you better listen good, damn it. Mankind will show you how extreme he can be next episode. Oh my god, this is absolutely insane, ladies and gentlemen. Smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, turn on notifications, and let's get this episode started. Only contest is a cable match, and interesting first we have John Morrison. And his opponent making his way to the ring now, Braun Strowman. And here we go, folks. Braun Strowman entering the ring. Look at the size of this athlete. Good God Almighty. And now John Morrison putting his hand out to shake it. But, oh no, this is not going to be good. Oh, what a kick to the face. And now here we go. This is not going to be good, ladies and gentlemen. Good God Almighty. Running power slam already. The ring shaking. And, oh, what a knee to the stomach. And now what is, oh, what a drop kick. Sending John Morrison all the way across the ring. And, oh, grabs him by the hair and slams him down. And now what is this? Double hand choke slam. Oh, my God. He's just destroying Morrison. Good God Almighty. I wonder who set this match up. Oh, my God. Good Lord. What an absolute battle. Well, actually, more like a beating because of Braun Strowman. Well, you know what I meant. But still, I guarantee it was that Triple H who set this match up who's... God damn it, so unfair. And now Morris is fighting for his life with his knees to the face. He goes to oh, throw a drop kick, but no, not a choke slam. Oh, God, on top of that table. You have got to be kidding me. He, oh my God, Morrison can barely stand up. Morrison can barely stand up. Running power slam through a table. Here's your winner, Braun. Strowman! Following contest is a hardcore tornado tag team elimination match. And it is for the WWT Indy Series Tag Team Championships. Introducing first we have Chavo, Eddie Guerrero. And here we go, ladies. This is one hell of a matchup. One one slobber knocker, goddammit. And their opponents, they are the current reigning defending world tag team champions, Kane and the Undertaker. Oh no, this is not going to be good. He's throwing those belts down like nothing. And, oh, Eddie Guerrero may have made the biggest mistake of his life going after The Undertaker like that. Good God Almighty. And now Undertaker already choke slam all the way from hell. Now Kane going to have a turn. Kane now picking him up. Already going for a tombstone. But what is this? Eddie Guerrero off the ropes. Knocks him down. And now Undertaker going after Eddie Guerrero. Throws him to the outside of the ring and now kicking the hell out of him on the outside. And now Chavo Guerrero in control. Chavo, oh, knocks down the big red machine. Off the rope, springboard. Oh, what a moonsault. Cover one and not even a two count. And oh, the big red machine taking his head off. And now Kane with that sidewalk, oh, sidewalk slam. Goes for a cover one and a one count. And oh, what an uppercut! The best uppercut in the business, goddammit! And now he oh spears him into the corner. And now what is this? Oh no! He goes for a roll up. Can he go for it? No. Kane. Oh God, Kane. With a oh back body drop. 
And not another choke slam! Oh my god, you've gotta be kidding me! Undertaker has got Eddie Guerrero up! Oh god! Oh my god, two times into the steel post! And now, that oh, was an uppercut! And now, oh my god, he kicks him in the stomach! This, you can't be, no, no, no! He's going for a last ride! Oh, last ride! Onto that steel step! Now Undertaker's got a steel chair, throwing it in. That was an absolute fail by The Undertaker. He was trying to throw it in there to Kane there. It's live, folks. It's live. And now he's got the, he's got that tag team title belt. Not, oh, right to the face of Eddie Guerrero. And now he's got him. Come on. He can barely stand as it is. Don't tell me. Oh, Tombstone on the outside. One, two, three. Eddie Guerrero has been eliminated. Kane now, with that steel folding chair that Undertaker threw in. Jamal could already barely stand as it is. Good God. No. Oh, right to the head. Right to the head of Chavo. Chavo's all by himself now. And no, 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 no. Oh, you're going to break his damn back, damn it. Somebody stop the damn match. And now, another... Choke slam on a steel folding chair. Holy shit. Undertaker in the ring now. Undertaker. Oh no, he's got Chavo Guerrero. And. Last ride through a table. And here we go, a cover. One, two, three, and here's your winners. And still the tag team champions. Undertaker and Kane. Good God almighty, what a slobber knocker. Let's get on with the main event. The following contest. Is a 10-man extreme over-the-top rope battle royal, and it is for the Intercontinental Championship. Energetic first, the three challengers in the ring now. Brock Lesnar and his opponent, Batista, and his opponent, the world's largest athlete, The Big Show. And making his way to the ring now, he is the current reigning defending hardcore champion, the current reigning defending extreme champion, and the current reigning defending intercontinental champion. He is the suicidal, homicidal, genocidal, death defying Sabu. Now, if Sabu loses this matchup, he just has to get eliminated, and he will lose that intercontinental championship. Remember, just the intercontinental championship. But the thing is, he hasn't been defeated for his hardcore title or his extreme belt yet. So still, and here we go. The matchup has started. Oh, Brock Lesnar with a huge right hand. He's got him up already. F5. What the hell? And of course, this was set up by, by God damn it, it was set up by Triple H and not a Batista bomb. You have got to be kidding me. What the hell? These men are just teaming up. Oh, what a huge boot to the face by the Big Show. Big Show with a knockout punch to the face and now, oh, and now he runs into the Batista. Here we go. It's Brock Lesnar now going after the Big Show, but he can't knock him down, but, oh, God, Brock Lesnar gets turned inside out, and, oh, what a headbutt. Oh, God, he almost kicked his head off there. Sidewalk slam to Batista. Good Lord. The next entry in the mat. Oh, the match. Matt Hardy, chair shot. He knocks the big giant down. Another chair shot. He's clearing house here. Only way to win this match. Wait a minute. Twist of fate to Sabu. And now Matt Hardy. Wait. Oh, no. Matt Hardy gets a suplex on top of that steel chair. Oh, God. Just broke the chair right over his skull there. And now what is this? Brock Lesnar. F5 to the big show. And now, oh, Matt Hardy wanting to win the Intercontinental Championship. Gold. Good Lord. And he throws him. Wait a minute. Oh, he throws him. Matt Hardy has been eliminated. Next participants in the matchup, Roman Reigns and Rusev. Good. Oh, what a kick to the face. And Rusev. And wait a minute. Rusev and Roman Reigns trying to eliminate the Big Show here. They're trying to throw him overboard. Rusev and Roman Reigns might do it. Oh, they eliminated the Big Show. But wait a minute. Superman punch. Superman punch. Good God almighty, what a matchup. Oh, poor Sabu. Superman punch across the table. And now, what is this, Roman Reigns? Oh, God, put Sabu through a table, damn it. Good Lord, I killed him. And now, what is this? Brock Lesnar. Brock Lesnar goes over the top rope. He's also eliminated, damn it. Participants of the match, Dean Ambrose and Brett the Hitman Hart. Oh, good Lord. 
What a shot with that ladder extreme rule. Oh no. Not the dirty deeds on top of the ladder. You have got to be kidding me. Sabu's in a serious predicament here. And wait a minute. No, oh, right hand. He's trying to eliminate him. Breath the Hitman Hart's trying to eliminate him. And now wait a minute. Every superstar in that ring right now is trying to eliminate Sabu. Can they get him overboard? Sabu. Sabu has been eliminated. There's going to be a new Intercontinental Champion here tonight. It took five men to eliminate him. But still, he's still the hardcore champion. And he's still the WWE Series Extreme Champion. But, whoa, oh, good lord, what a suplex by Rusev. But he will no longer be the Intercontinental after this matchup is ended. Oh, no, he roll right back in the ring here. Brett the Hitman Hart. Oh, he eliminates Rusev. He eliminates Rusev. But Superman punch to Brett the Hitman Hart. The last participant in the match, Kevin Owens, cross body. But... Oh, good lord, just gets taken out there. And now what is this? Oh, what a DDT. Oh, five men left in this in this matchup. Who's going to become the new Intercontinental Champion? Oh, Brett the Hitman Hart gets kicked. Almost across the ring there. Oh, no. Dirty Deeds from Ambrose. That was an epic fail. Good God Almighty, you know. Batista with a huge right hand. Left hand. Whatever the hell you want to call it. Good God Almighty, we need another announcer, damn it. And now, oh, what a power bomb. Roman Reigns goes for a Superman punch, but oh god, gets reversed instead. And now Batista, power bomb, and drop kick into the corner by Bret the Hitman Hart. And now, oh what a shot of the head! And Bret the Hitman Hart going to eliminate Kevin Owens. But wait a minute, Kevin Owens now, oh running, running kick right to the face, and he. Oh, he throws Brett the Hitman Hart out. Brett the Hitman Hart has been eliminated. Superman punched by Roman Reigns. Four men remain. And now, oh, he's fighting back, damn it. He's fighting him back. And, oh, God, he just broke the, the, cha or the ladder right over the head of Roman Reigns in a huge power bomb. Kevin Owens now going to fly himself at Batista, but, oh, God. Batista's laying everybody out here. Belly to belly suplex. Oh my god, Dean Ambrose goes over the top rope. He's eliminated. We're so close to having a new Intercontinental Champion. Oh god, and now Batista. Oh, what a shot right to the head. Kevin Owens has been eliminated. Two men remain. Oh, what a swinging neck breaker by Batista. Batista now. Hey, having two tables set up in the middle of the ring. He's got him up in a pile driver position. Backwards too, no. Oh my god, that could have broke his damn neck, damn it. And now he throws him over the top rope. Batista thinks he's won. But Roman Reigns slowly getting back up here. Oh, what a shot. And now, oh, Batista, here's your winner. And a new WWT Indy Series Intercontinental Champion, Batista. That was one hell of a matchup, but still it's very unfair to Sabu. He had to challenge nine other superstars in order to defend his belt, which he did not do. He ended up, well, he ended up losing his Intercontinental Championship, but he's still the Extreme Champion, the Hardcore Champion. So, anyway, he still got those two legendary streaks. Anyway, smash the like button, subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to stay awesome. And guys, don't forget to stay tuned for the next video. See you guys later.